My name's Lucy Rush, I'm the Director of Practice and Quality and I'm also the Principal Social Worker for Hertfordshire County Council. I have worked for Hertfordshire for the last four years, just over four years, and prior to being in this role I was the Head of Adult Disability Services for the West of Hertfordshire. We are holding a recruitment day on the 3rd of October. Um, we'll be holding that at the Hertfordshire Development Centre which is in Stevenage. We're hoping that by making it a little bit later um, people will be able to join us after to work for example or possibly after um, a day at college. On the day we're really hoping to have lots of representation from across the different departments in adult social care and we've got a particular focus for this recruitment day on social work and occupational therapy. We're really really keen to hear from as many occupational therapists and social workers as we possibly can. We'll have lots of people on the day who'll be able to talk to you about what it's like working for Hertfordshire, the different opportunities that we've got in the different types of services so we'll have representation from our um, adult disability services who generally work with adults of a working age, people who may have a learning disability or a long-term health condition. But we'll also have representation um, from uh, social workers and occupational therapists who work in our older adults service. That will also include people who work within the hospitals. We're really, really keen to share as many opportunities as we can in how we work with our partners in health. Really important is that we will also have some really um, specific information and advice on the day about our Connected Lives Gateway service. This is a new service, it's part of our um, prevention offer and the roles that we have within the Gateway are slightly different to what we would think of as a traditional role per se in terms of social work or occupational therapy. These roles are much more focused on prevention, on enablement and really, really working with people for a period of around about 12 weeks to get people maximised and optimised in terms of what and how they can live their lives as independently as possible. We will have representation there as well on the day from safeguarding. So we have a safeguarding service within Hertfordshire. That's slightly different to how um, other authorities manage safeguarding, but we're really, really proud of our safeguarding service and we have lots of opportunities within safeguarding but also within our specialist dolls team as well. I'm really keen on the day that we're also able to showcase our learning and development offer so we'll have representatives from our practice development team um, and our practice quality team. I'm hoping that, they, that they'll be able to share um, lots of ideas about how we support people in terms of developing their CPD, how we support people to progress but also to be able to talk to newly qualified social workers about our AS YE programme and our NQOT programme as well. I think we've got really, really good offers in Hertfordshire in how we support newly qualified staff and how we also support people through developing their practice once they're post-qualified um, two years. For the recruitment event, it's really important as well that we provide as much opportunity as we can for people to come and talk to us about our diversity and inclusion workforce strategy. One thing that we're so proud of at Hertfordshire is that we are inclusive and we really want to encourage a really diverse range um, of workforce of practitioners and, and we want our workforce to be really representative of our community, of our wider community. We will have some representation on the day as well from our staff board, so we have an adult care services staff board. The staff board are really, really important in contributing to and helping us make decisions about how we shape our services. And so I would really encourage people to come and have conversations about what other things we're able to offer outside of just the usual roles um, of social work and occupational therapy. I think we've got some really, really positive opportunities in Hertfordshire for how we support staff. We are really inclusive, as I say, and we do offer flexible working. We do really, really take into account that people's lives are different, and we really want to support and encourage as many people as we can to come and work for us, come and work with us, or potentially come back to practice. I think really strongly in Hertfordshire, we've got a really good CPD offer. So our continuous professional development really, really thinks about how we can make sure that practitioners feel as confident as they possibly can in the roles that they're doing. But we also look at wider learning and development opportunities as well. We've got really good opportunities for people to join us um, to undertake research, for example. And we hold research in really high esteem within our adult social care services. We've got 
opportunities um, to refer friends, for example. So if you come to work for us and you know somebody who is thinking about coming to work for Hertfordshire, we've got a refer a friend um, scheme. And we've also got um, opportunities for things such as welcome payments. So for people that are joining us, um, we do offer um, welcome payments and a relocation package as well. We offer a really competitive salary range. So we have a starting point for newly qualified OTs and social workers, but we then also have opportunities for progression um, and we really, really encourage people to, to think about what they want out of their careers and how they want to develop. So we will have opportunities on the day and through our recruitment um, in terms of senior social work roles, advanced practitioner roles, um, newly qualified social workers and occupational therapists as well. So we're really, really looking for a broad range of people to come and meet with us on the day. So I'd say in Hertfordshire, we're really guided by our RISE values and our RISE values really encompass everything that we want to do and how we want to work with people. So RISE really means we want to improve residents' lives and we want to work with integrity, but we also want to work sustainably. We really, really want to change champion equity, inequality and fairness.